Scott. And Helen. And TJ. And today is the day. It's Christmas Day. Well, uh, sort of. Today's the day we're going to go down and finalise the purchase on our boat. So, we've got a long drive ahead. And if you want to join us with us, come along and we'll uh, show you around everything and talk you through what we're doing today all along the journey. What do you reckon, Flash? Should we get going? It was Christmas Day, didn't it? Middle of April, and here we are. The weather gods decided overnight that it was going to chuck a load of snow down. Well, uh, picturesque, anyway. What do you think? Hmm? What do you think? So, welcome on board, Karma. Um, the deal's just been done. We've signed for it, so we are now the proud owners of this Atlanta 24. Um, when we arrived at the boat, um, obviously we've only seen pictures, so we had a good look around it, and we did find a couple of minor issues, uh, all cosmetic. Um, one being this bit of boarding has had condensation on it as you can see and the backboard of this is is rotted away but it just means that we just need to replace this one board here that's fine and also I, I was already aware um, of the condensation issue on the ceiling I was told about this before we came um, so we know that's bad but it just uh, is cosmetic again um, and we can take that down and we can um, get it relined or replaced however but it has reflected in the uh, the price of what we've paid for the boat so we made an agreement uh, in principle over the phone um, but when I found these couple of little issues I have managed to negotiate uh, a reduction in that as well so we are happy um, there's other little jobs that we'll need doing to make it our own but um, yeah we uh, were happy or are we are we happy yeah you happy TJ I mean did it still cost what how, cost how much was it I'm not telling you wouldn't tell a Bobby that. You don't need to know. So yeah, one thing about this boat uh, is uh, what is attracted to is the owners of this boat have had it from day one. So um, they've got all the paperwork going back, including the original purchase um, of the boat when they bought it in 1991. So yeah, um, sorry, 1990 it was. 1990. 1990. So yeah, it's 31 year old. I think he said in a week's time. So yeah, but this is our boat, Karma. So we're going to replace all the cushions, we're going to take all them out today. Um, we've got a supplier who's going to redo them for us uh, and the curtains. Um, like I say, we need to replace the carpet as well. Um, this is all things that we want to do anyway.
ahead and it is going to get anti fouled hopefully next week here at this marina before it gets transported up to the Peak Forest Canal where we are. Quite a nice marina. Hey TJ, that boat's named after you. That's dad when he's had loads of beer. Oh, no, trooper. I thought you said trumper. Sandwich TJ. I don't have a sandwich. Didn't bring any duck food, did you? Sandwich picnic, TJ? Yes, yes, yes. We can eat that while we're on our way home then. And then when we get back, we'll, uh, we'll finish off with a roundup of, uh, of the day. So then, the roundup. Um, you're probably thinking, hang on, you know, they left Buxton this morning and he was scraping snow off the window and now they're sat in the backyard with shorts on and sunglasses. Um, well, we got a bit of a confession to make. So, to make the experience a bit better for you viewers, we've done the other vlogs on just a little 
old camera that came out the cupboard that we've had forever and a day more. Um, and we noticed when we were editing, sometimes the volume wasn't brilliant, and sometimes the panning uh, of the, the shot wasn't brilliant. So we thought, you know what, we, we'll invest a few pounds and we'll get a, a better camera. So we went on and we bought this camera from, um, let's say, a delivery company that will deliver next day up until 10 o'clock. Big, big brand, we won't mention who it is. Um, and they delivered it at 10 to 10 the day before we were going to look at the boat. So we've lost a bit of footage along the way. Do you want to tell them what happened with all the footage that we did in the car on the journey? So obviously I was doing the driving, uh, Helen was supposed to be doing the, the, the film and the vlog along the way and we don't know what's happened to the footage but it wasn't on the SD card when we got back home. But that was least of our worries, I've got a confession as well. Because it's got an external mic on this uh, new camera and it has lots of different settings on it and every time I switched it on and off I must have been adjusting the volume. So as you'll have heard throughout this vlog, the volume's gone up, it's gone down, some of it wasn't even there, so that was that was my bad. And also I noticed that the date was on the screen, which was the wrong date, it said something of 2020. So we're going to show you that we went to see the boat on the 11th of April 2021, and we bought the boat, that is what happened. And today is a week later, so are we on the 18th, 18th of April? Um, what happened was, because it was school holidays uh, in Derbyshire this last week and lockdown restrictions have been released slightly uh, to allow caravans and uh, motor homes to get away to, to sites, um, we took the privilege of that, owning a motor home, that we went away for the week. So I said, I know what I'll do. I'll take the laptop with us and I'll do the editing while we're away on the 4G Wi-Fi we've got in the motor home. Uh, and I'll do it on the laptop. Well, when we got the laptop there and set it up, the laptop I've got won't support the program that I use for the editing. So, um, yeah, we told you at the beginning that this is all brand new and not something that is, you know, what we do for a day-to-day -day, um, thing. We can use technology. You're probably wondering where TJ is. Well, he's been without his technology for a week. So he's inside on Xbox and we probably won't see him for the rest of the day now, catching up on Fortnite or whatever else he plays. But anyway, that's our confession and that's why it's took so long to get the video uploaded because we've had to wait until we've come home today. So where are we up to? We have bought the boat, as you'll have seen earlier in the vlog. Um, there was a few issues with it. It wasn't as described as well as what it should have been um, but it's all okay there was a point where I thought we weren't going to purchase the boat uh, which was a real downer we went away and had a tour but we went back to the owner uh, ex expressed our issues uh, and what, what wasn't described um, or what wasn't shown especially in the pictures so the boat itself is actually sound it's you know the whole everything it's, it's solid as a rock but the boat's 31 year old and it's a little bit tired in places but everything is cosmetic so we're not worried about that the boat uh, is still tumbled in marina at the moment uh, this next week it is getting its anti-foul done you'll have seen that it looked a bit tired on the outside so we have an all uh, fresh anti-foul putting on and uh, while the boat's out the water we decide to have the engine serviced as well so then it'll be transported on 26, 26 which is a week tomorrow um, and it's been brought up by a professional company on the back of a trailer up to North Cheshire Cruising Club which is its high lane which is just an arm off the Macclesfield Canal. Uh, we'll pick the boat up hopefully early afternoon, we'll take the camera with us, hopefully we'll know what we're doing with the camera by this point. Um, read the instructions the destruction manual um, and then we'll take the camera with us and we'll show you the, the, the short journey down to Furnaceville Marina. We have got a couple of swing bridges and a lift bridge to operate, no locks, um, 
but it'll all be brand new experience for us and you know you come along and join it with us but yeah so apologies again for the bit of a technical issue that we've had but I hope you carry on watching our vlogs and enjoy the journey because as of next Monday is when it all really starts to happen. As we're doing the repairs in the first instance we will take the camera with us every time and we'll show you along the way. Do you want to tell them what you've been doing while I've been away? Shopping. We had to bring the motorhome home mid-holiday because we were going to two different sites because there was that much well, I won't say junk, but there was that much shopping for interior, interior design, and yeah. So, from what you've seen the boat on the first part of this vlog to what it's going to be like, it's going to be a total transformation. So, yeah, we're excited. So, until the next time, we're going to say goodbye and stay safe. <laughs>